This is Social Work Month at CHEO, a time to celebrate the social workers who hold many CHEO families together. And to salute the legacy of the pioneer who started it all. I think at that time most hospitals had a social worker or two. And when I got the job, they said, build a social work department, period. That was 1974. Chio brand new, Airdrie Thompson Guppy, its first social worker, told create a department of four and put them where needed most. But she knew that wouldn't cut it. So she challenged hospital execs for an immediate expansion. And that's why I'm here tonight to ask you for four more social work positions so that I can do the job that needs to be done. Told her pitch was pretty gutsy. That was a pretty provocative presentation. But convincing. Eight social workers to play a role now so valued at CHEO, the department has grown to 50. I think that the group is very special and I'm very proud of them. And I think it's because of the success of some of those early decisions that she made um, that uh, the role of social work has been appreciated so much. We provide support, we do counseling, we, you know, we're really there to follow families through their health care journey. But while social workers provide emotional support, donations help them to provide instrumental support. The cost of parking, transportation, equipment, or loss of one parent's income can all put families into crisis. What other organizations can we uh, include in making sure that some of those financial costs uh, are alleviated? And we, as a last resort, like I said, we use foundation dollars and um, we spend money on families that really, really need it. Years after retirement, Thomas Guppy remains invested in what happens at CHEO, literally. For her 75th birthday, she collected cash instead of presents and handed over an envelope. Now 82, she returns each year to present a very special award. It's the Airdrie Thompson Guppy Social Work Award of Excellence, and I didn't make that up. Somebody else <laughs> did. <laughs> Thompson Guppy had her first hint at how crucial support was for families when decades ago her younger brother had to undergo surgery. Her parents then told not to visit because it would upset him. She says hospitals now, and CHEO in particular, have come full circle in learning how to care not just for their patients, but for their families. And your continued support makes a difference in the lives of the children at CHEO. Please visit CHEOFoundation.com and donate today.